Hello Virgo. Namaste. It is I, Gina Louisa, here just to do your reading for July of 2016. I have already done the praying and the shuffling, laying out of the cards, and I'm going to get right to it. Your card reading opens with the Seven of Diamonds over the King of Hearts. Wow. Okay, so this is you investing your money in your something that you really, really believe in. This is about investing in something you believe in, something that fills your heart, something you feel really, really good about. That's what that's about. This is investing your resources, your energy, and your money into. And this is something that, that it, it's not just home, it's like out there. But it's something that you really feel big and good about in your heart. Uh, perhaps you could be romancing someone and spending money on it. Uh, because because um, it seems like it's out there. Because you could be traveling. Because it's, uh, you know, it's, it's, but it's something that you really love. So it's um, about investing in something that you really, really love this July. Let's see what, what else we can gather from this. Okay, we have the three of diamonds over the ace of clubs. And the, the, of course, three of diamonds is again your finances and your um, the flow of abundance of yours. And it's your. You're starting to get a laser beam focus of ideas. Okay, so that's what's going on. Okay. I'm starting to understand this. Okay, you have the red deck and the blue deck. Okay, so here you have you have a financial yearning then. Instead of just in investing, okay? This is a financial yearning. You're feeling a lack, okay, of your outer realm, your whole world, that which you love. You want to be totally financially independent. And you're feeling this lack in your heart. And you're like, so this is what has got your attention. So this is you are getting a laser beam focus of your mind focused on not just that you know you want to be rich okay but the practical side and even the moral side of a flow of abundance this is where your mind is focused the club a focus because yeah the club has got that tri the trinity in and of itself okay that's both halves of your mind and your heart are agreeing a laser beam focus of the, the magic of the universe is where the um clubs is the magic the esoteric realm your mind okay and it's all about your bringing in of abundance in a way that's going to fill your heart it's coming from the love in your heart okay it's not coming from greed it's not coming from a bad place it's coming from the ultimate king of hearts who is you know the king of hearts okay you're coming from the right place and you're manifesting abundance in your life coming up with the ideas let's see what the animal oracles can add we are having you have the panda over the mouse the panda is about sanctuary so your mind is all around your sanctuary you are building a sanctuary this is what you are you want to be in sanctuary you want to be in abundance and happiness with family around you complete abundance okay and mouse complete abundance over mouse that means yes you can attain it all right there is nothing that mouse can't get to when mouse wants it. It, it, it it's clandestine nobody sees mouse you know unless a mouse wants to be seen you know mouse goes after what it wants <laughs> it can digging go around obstacles go up obstacles over obstacles chew through obstacles mouse can get what it wants to so that's what this is about this is telling you that your sanctuary the sweetness of life your sanctuary is where your heart and your mind is all around and you are going after it with a laser beam focus let's look at the second half of the month 
The second half of the month opens up with the five of diamonds over the jack of diamonds. Okay, so wow. <clears throat> this is saying that you have the resources it takes for a new venture. Your finances are balanced and full. It means you have enough money for a brand new venture. Jack is new. Jack means a new novice something, a brand new something, okay? And it's the diamond, so we have a new business adventure, a new idea, a new... Well, the idea is 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 the laser beam focus that we had in the first two weeks, okay? And now you're really investing in this new project. Let's see what the blue... The blue is saying the ten of hearts over the four of hearts. So we have the red deck... It's all about your money. Brand new project. You've got enough money to invest in this brand new project. You're celebrating. Okay? And your heart is wide open to receive. You've got all four corners stable. Your heart is in the right place. You're balanced and open and ready to receive. This is the celebration card. This is the da 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 Yes! <laughs> and that's exactly what this is. See? That's the celebration of the universe. The heart, filling your heart build as big as it can be because your heart is open and ready to be filled. Okay, let's see what the animal oracles can add. Okay. We've got the lion over the cobra. Like a lion over the cobra. A lion is about reaching out and abandoning loneliness, reaching out to others. That's what it means. It's about the, the abandoning the loneliness, trusting and reaching out to others. So that's why your heart is filled, okay? When you've got this new business venture, you feel secure that your finances are good so much so that you can reach out to a new adventure. A new financial adventure and in so doing your heart now is on fire and full and ready for love okay and and in the second half of the month you're really going to reach out it feels like you're going to reach out because your heart is open and ready and ready for love this says you're shedding your old skin anything that held you back in the past your old skin you know, you're not taking your skin along with you and growing with you. You're leaving it behind. And you can turn around and look and see everything that you used to be there. Every little bit of you. But that's not you anymore. No. You are a bigger self. And you haven't you haven't transformed into something new. You've become a bigger version of yourself. You've shed the old skin. You had to, it's about to, it's, you know, having to shed the old skin. You know, you can't bring your old skin with you like, like, Another creature that grows with its skin, okay? You are the creature that has to shed the old skin. Uh, it becomes tight. And it just doesn't fit you anymore. You've grown beyond the old you. Now, well, now you're going to shed that old skin. And it might be a little scary at first to be so vulnerable, you know, fresh and new. But understand that uh, as soon as you get that old skin off of you, you're instantly going to become durable again your fresh new self is going to try and and become durable and, and much more comfortable and ah oh, the, the, the better things you can be as this new improved you will recap just a little okay beginning of the month is about your feeling like you need more your finances are feeling yearning and from from the depths of your heart you want to be more okay which is bringing you a focus a laser beam focus idea okay how am i going to be more in this world okay first half of the month you're going to be more in this world it focuses on sanctuary it focuses on your sweetness and your sanctuary and how you're going to do anything you can to get there. You've got the resources, like little mouse, you can get there. Okay, second half of the month, you've got enough finances. You can afford to put your money into this new project. Wonderful. 
and it makes you so happy. You're blissful and celebrating. You're getting your wish. You are getting your wish. This is the wish card. You're getting your wish. Your heart's fulfillment. And now you're reaching out to others. You are reaching out and you're trusting. You're going to abandon that loneliness part of your life. And you're reaching out. You're shredding the old skin that you thought was you. This little version of yourself. And you're becoming a bigger, ah, more, more authentic self bigger version of yourself reaching out and incorporating more into your world but what a beautiful beautiful july for you virgos have a beautiful july and uh yeah let me know how it turns out really message me i'll be looking forward to it and i will see you next month